Hello, my name is Yustra and this is my implementation of the Lab 6 1-bit ALU on Logism. The top MUX00 select input is connected to the carry of the full adder. The 01 select input is connected to the NAND of A and B. The 10 select input is connected to the, to the XNOR of A and B. And the 11 select input is connected to the NOR of A and B. The bottom MUX00 select input is connected to the sum of the full adder. The 01 select input is connected to the AND of A and B. The 10 select input is connected to the XOR of A and B. And the 11 select input is connected to the OR of A and B. With this implementation, Y1 when the op is 00, 0 is going to display the carry of the addition of a b and c in and in other inputs uh, of other like values of op it will show the inverted logic gates of a and b which is in this case nand x nor and nor and y zero when op is zero zero will show the sum of a b and c in and at other values of op um, which is 0, 1, 1, 0, or 1, 1, it will show the uh, logic between A and B, which in this case would be either AND, the XOR, or the OR of A and B. The object view of my 1-bit ALU circuit, um, we can see here that we are at the full adder selection, 0, 0, and so if we were to make the addition of 1 plus 0 plus 0, which would be 1, we can see that the sum is equal to 1 and we have no carry um, output. If we were to do a 1 plus 1, which would be 2, we can see that we have a sum of 0 and a carry of 1. Um, and if we have an addition 1 plus 1 plus 1, which would be 3, we have a sum of 1 and a carry bit of 1 also. Um, if our selection now is for the NAND slash AND selection, we can see that the AND of A and B, when both of them are 1, is 1, um, but the NAND, when is correctly working as well, when both A and B is 0. If our selection is then the XNOR and the XOR, we can see that when both A and B is 0, we can see that the XNOR is 1, and when they are different, then the XOR is 1. And lastly, when the selection is at the NOR and the OR selection, the when either one of them is 1, or if both are 1, we can see that the OR is 1, but when both of them are 0, we can see that the NOR is 1.